Unfortunately, he is my literal child. <laughs> He's literally so perfect, I can't even. So as you can see, this one's fully blue and then this one is half brown. Will you make an Instagram page for the puppy? And the answer is yes! High five! Good boy! Hi guys, it's Jordan and today I am going to have you guys meet my puppy! Woo! So you guys already have seen my dog, but I figured today's video could be kind of like a Q&A for my new puppy so that way you guys can finally like I'll formally introduce him to you and you can learn all of the like fun little parts about his personality. So he's actually right here. <laughs> he's sleeping right behind me. Come here. Come say hi to the camera. Don't be shy. Go say hi. Look. He chose to sleep behind me. Let's wake up and go say hi. He's been really, really sleepy. Okay. Come on, remember. Oh my gosh. Are you just a baby? Oh, you're so tired. Are you so tired? Oh, you big yawn. <laughs> what do you think? Is that a bright studio light? Poor little puppy, you're so cute. Okay, so actually, if you guys remember like six years ago <laughs> on YouTube, Tags were super popular, and there was this thing called the furry friend tag, and I figured, you know what? That's a good way for you guys to get to know um, my puppy. Oh my goodness, stop eating my hair, dude. <laughs> and so we're gonna just go ahead and answer the questions from the furry friend tag, and then I also asked you guys on Instagram, um, what are your questions for my new puppy? And we'll answer them in this YouTube video. Dude, stop biting. <laughs> And so I will also be giving shout outs to you guys for those questions that will come in like the second part of the video. So let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty, starting off with the furry friend tag questions. So the very first question is, what is your pet's name? Oh my gosh, she's eating my hair. Dude, stop eating my hair. Stop eating my hair. Oh my gosh. His name is Atlas. Woo! Little Atlas. And his middle name is Kama. <laughs> Williams. <laughs> He's so precious. And actually, if you want to know the reasoning behind why I picked those names, um, his first name and middle name, check out the video also on this channel where I named my puppy. Huh. Oh my gosh, you just want to bite everything right now, don't you? All right, he's playing with a toy now, but he's right over there. Oh, also, fun fact, actually, you guys know our other dog, Logan, our family dog. Um, we actually did a furry friend tag for Logan six years ago on Audrey's channel, my sister, All Around Audrey. And I recently watched the video, and it was so crazy to see how much we've changed and how much Logan has changed. Insane. So I figured this would be a super fun video to film while well, he's just a little baby puppy and then like to watch in a few years to see how much he's changed and grown. It's gonna be crazy. Question number two is what kind of pet is it and what breed? So obviously he's a dog and he is a mini Australian Shepherd and his coat pattern is a blue merle. There's Australian Shepherds and then there's different types. So there's toys, minis, and regular Australian Shepherds and the toys are like they get like as big as he is right now. And the minis get like as big as how Logan is, so like a medium sized dog. That's how big he'll get is hopefully around the size of Logan. He could get a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller, but generally just a medium dog. And then Australian Shepherds are like bigger dogs. So he's a mini and he'll get as big as Logan. Next question is how old is your pet? And he is about 12 weeks old right now. So when we picked him up, he was 10 weeks, I want to say? Yeah. Next up is what are some unique things about his personality? And I love this question because I literally, all leading up to getting him, I was so excited to meet him because I didn't know what his personality was going to be like and every dog is kind of different. And so he um, loves to chew. <laughs> he chews everything and anything he can, which I think is pretty normal for puppies. Like Logan did the same thing, so that's normal. But something funny about him is that he chews my hair like crazy. He loves hair. Don't you? You just love to chew hair. Oh my goodness. Look. Look, he's literally chewing my hair already and I just picked him up. You just love to chew hair. That's not okay. Don't chew my hair. <laughs> something else unique about him is that he's very adventurous and very curious. 
He's also like super brave. He wasn't nervous at all to come um, home with us or anything. He just he just gets it. Like he just knew that this is where he's supposed to be. And also he's such a genius dog. Like he's so smart. Like Logan is very smart too, but he is so smart. And I just, I, I can't, I can't even. He already knows so many tricks and everything. It's insane. What is your relationship like with your pet? And I would say we have a good relationship. Don't you think? Um, actually, he is my literal child. <laughs> like, I am so protective over him already. And, um, yeah, he's my child. I spend, like, all day with him, and I just love him so much. Literally, he, I, I love him so much. And also, he thinks of me as his mama, because to him, I'm the alpha. And so he follows me around the house and everything, and he whimpers when I leave him, which it's something I'm trying to work on because I don't want him to build up separation anxiety, but he always wants to be around me and then he also struggles like eating and using the bathroom and just sleeping if I'm not there. <laughs> so he's very attached to me and I'm very attached to him. Alright, and now moving on to your guys' questions from Instagram. If you want to, make sure you don't miss out on any other Q&A or shout out opportunities. Make sure you're following Instagram at justjordan33 underscore. This is from Rihanna.Sahara. I hope I pronounced your name. I, I'm so sorry if I didn't. Ah, dude! Ah! Oh my gosh. Ah, let go! Let go. They asked, how big will he be when he's full grown and in comparison to Logan? So he is going to get to be about the size of a medium dog. So he'll be like the same size as Logan is what they estimate but he could always be a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller. And also keep in mind, like on videos and pictures, he actually looks a lot bigger than he is in person because he's so fluffy and just very fuzzy and fluffy. It makes him look bigger, but he's actually really teeny. Tyfs.smiles says, what was the first thing you noticed about your puppy? The very first thing that I noticed was first off, how perfect he is. He's literally so perfect. I can't even, except he loves to chew. And the very first thing that I was so shocked about was how tiny he is. He was so small when we picked him up. Like literally when we picked him up, he was about five pounds. Not kidding. Literally tiny. Um, they said he was seven pounds, but I'm pretty sure he was five pounds. And so he was very, very, very small. And he's already grown so much since we got him. Because as you guys know, if you've seen the video where I picked him up, he kind of struggled eating before he came home with us because one of his siblings left and it made him very sad and he didn't want to eat. So he lost a lot of weight before we got him. And then when we got him, he immediately was eating and he was immediately perfectly fine and doing really great. And so now he's grown a lot and he's bigger now and now he's about 10 pounds. You're 10 pounds. Look at you, you've grown so much. So he's growing very, very fast. Alright, this is from that TYFFP. Thank you so much for your question. And it says, How did you know that he was the right one? And actually, this was really hard for me to decide because I was so nervous that what if I picked the wrong dog? What if our personalities don't mesh? What if it's just not the right dog? And I was really stressed about it because when I like was looking at the dogs and everything, I really wanted to base it off of personality and I was really wanting to meet them beforehand. But unfortunately, due to coronavirus, we weren't able to meet them before. And so I kind of just had to look at the pictures and decide. And so I had the whole family help me. We looked at a bunch of different places and a bunch of different um, types. We found out that mini Australian Shepherds would work best for us. And I think he, that mini Australian Shepherds fit my lifestyle and my personality best right now. I had the whole family look at the pictures and we all felt like he just was the one. He just seemed different and he just felt right. And so we decided that, you know, I just decided, I was like, you know what? All right, this is the dog. And we went full in, um, we fully committed and now we have him and it worked out so well. And I'm actually very, very glad. This question is from Z underscore four, six, four, five underscore. And it says, are you going to take him with you if you move out? By the way, he's so cute. Thank you. I'm literally obsessed with him. I think he's adorable. And yes, I'm going to take him with me when I move out. Um, he's fully my dog. I paid for him. Um, he's my full responsibility. And yeah, he's 100% he's my dog. And so he will be coming with me 
when I move out too. Yes! This one is from editing.tyf and it says, has the puppy's eyes always been blue or did they change over time? And I actually really like that question because his eyes to me are so interesting. I think they're very, very pretty and very unique too, pretty rare. So he, when we were looking at pictures of him and trying to decide which um, puppy to get, his eyes, I remember both of them were blue. And then, but dogs' eyes can always change like when they're little. Now his eyes are gonna stay the same. He's too old to have them change, but they're kind of like babies. Their eyes can change when they're little. And so now his right eye is fully blue and his left eye is half blue, half brown. And then there's a little sliver of blue in the brown. Here, I'm gonna show you this picture. So as you can see, this one's fully blue and then this one is half brown half blue, and then there's that little sliver of blue. His eyes are so cool and pretty rare too. I love them. TYFVHS said, how much time do you usually spend with him? And let me just say, literally all day. Um, oh my gosh! That's my favorite something to Let go! Let go, sit down, sit down. I spend all day with him because he is kind of mischievous because he's so adventurous and curious. And so I want to make sure that he doesn't get into anything that he's not supposed to. TYFS.loving says, what is his favorite toy to play with so far? And also please say hi, Michaela. Hi, Michaela. And he doesn't really have a favorite toy. He'll honestly, he loves all his toys. He has a lot of toys. But he particularly likes the rope toys, which is kind of interesting because Logan never likes the rope toys. And then recently, this one he's been loving. Last question is from just underscore Jordan 33 edits, and it says, will you make an Instagram page for the puppy? And the answer is yes! He actually already has an Instagram page, and it is called Atlas and Jordan, and that is his um, username for all socials. So he's also on TikTok and on YouTube too, at Atlas and Jordan, right? Username. Oh my goodness. All right, that is it for all of the questions for little Atlas. And now I wanted to show you guys some of his tricks that he knows because he is such a smart dog. I wanted to um, show him off a little bit. All right, and also keep in mind, he learns these tricks in literally less than 30 minutes. I don't even understand how smart he is. Like, I, he just gets it. He's so genius dog and I, I don't understand, but it's crazy. And for how young he is, the fact that he knows this many tricks that's not normal. I don't understand, but he's so good. High five. Good boy. High five. Aw. All right, twirl. Twirl. Good boy, twirl. Ready? Lay down. Lay down. Good. Now army crawl. Army crawl. Yes. Good boy. Good boy. Shake. all his tricks that he knows right now. Oh, and then also something really cute is when he gets excited, he'll like, um, he'll put his paw on my knee, like he's like this, like Jordan, like, give me treats. <laughs> it's really cute. And then also he'll hop like a bunny when he is super playful. All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Um, I'm so glad you guys finally got to meet little Atlas and just learn more about his personality. I mean, you guys have already seen videos about him, but to learn more about his personality and everything. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you all next time. Bye! You say bye! Say bye! <laughs> oh. <laughs>